Caldwell County says it's ready and able to operate as a vaccine hub, but leaders say they haven't heard back about whether the state will approve their request. This has been frustrating for the county judge there in KXAN's Jail of Washington live in our newsroom to explain some of the challenges the county is up against now and why they're desperate to get approved as soon as possible. Jayla? Well, right now, Caldwell County Judge is trying to finalize their hub application, modeling after its neighboring county, Bastrop, that has been approved. And they're trying to get details as to what Bastrop did to ensure approval, but are getting no direction. You can see here on this map, more than 75 counties have been approved as hubs by DSHS. We're told what's happening is those in Caldwell County want to try to get a vaccine, are having to make the drive, which isn't ideal for those 65 and older, which are some of the most people who are at highest risk. Caldwell County Judge Hoppy Hayden says they need their own hub so that they can vaccinate more people. Right now, there are individual providers, but the county has no oversight as to how many vaccines it receives and does not coordinate appointments. Now, unlike most other counties that have been approved as hubs in Caldwell, there is no public health department, which is creating some unique challenges. But the bottom line is, per capita, we're, we're suffering from COVID as badly, if not worse, than, than some of the other counties. I just would like somebody to reach out to our county and say, if you can get this set up the way neighboring counties have surrounding you uh, that don't have a health department, then you will get a hub. We asked the state health department about these concerns. A spokesperson said, quote, the supply of the vaccine is provided to Texas each week by the federal government, which remains very limited and prevents us from providing larger amounts everywhere, which we would like to. 1,200 doses have been allocated to providers in Caldwell County to this point, and that we will continue to increase future ones in the upcoming weeks. Now, in the meantime, Judge Hayden is forming a coalition of rural county judges so that they can advocate more for their communities. I'm live in the newsroom, Jayla Washington, KXAN News.